In this video, I'll show you how to fix Roblox error code 268. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And please do watch this video right until the end to know all of the steps. So here we are currently on Roblox, but let's go and get into our desktop. So the first thing you want to go and do is it's something quite basic, but all you want to do is go and try and restart your computer. You probably already tried that, but it's just one of the most basic things you can go and do to go and see if that helps. However, if it doesn't, then the next thing you want to go and do is, is open up your file explorer. So here we are, and all you want to do is go into your local disk, then you want to go and click on users, then you want to go and locate your name, so mine is Rob. Then once you're on your user, all you want to do is go and click on view, and then you need to go and enable hidden items, just like so. Then you're gonna go and see this folder here called app data, so double click on that. Then go and click on local, and you want to scroll down until you can go and see Roblox. As you can see, here it is. Go and double click on that there. And then you want to go and click on versions. And then as you can see, you've got the version here. You want to go and click on the most up-to-date version, and it's gonna to have the most recent date modified to go and click on it there. And then you want to come to the bottom, which is the Roblox player launcher. Then all you want to do is right click on it and you can go and click on troubleshoot compatibility. This is gonna see if it can go and detect any issues and then you can go and click try recommended settings. And then you can go and click test a program just like so. And it's gonna go and say test. And then Roblox is gonna go and update and hopefully go and launch up just fine. Then once it's finished, it's gonna go and say Roblox is successfully installed. Click the play button in any game to go and join the action. So you can go and click okay and then you can go and click on next and then you can go and click cancel. Then you'll notice this folder is empty, so you can go and click on versions up here, and as you can see, there's a brand new one. However, if that still hasn't worked, then all you want to do is go and locate Roblox Player Launcher, click on it once and right click on it, and you want to go down to properties at the bottom, then we're gonna go and drag this up for you guys. Then you need to go and click on compatibility here. Then you need to go and locate compatibility mode and you need to go and select run this program in compatibility mode four, click here and then you want to go and change this to Windows seven. Click there and then you need to come to the bottom and go and click apply. Then you can press OK. Then you can go and try and launch it from going and clicking play on a Minecraft game. However, if you've gone and tried those steps and it still isn't working, the best thing you can go and do is, is fully reinstall Roblox. So to go and do that, go and click on the Windows logo in the bottom left and then go and click on the settings cog. Click here and it's going to go and launch your settings. Then go and click on apps or you can go and search for apps. Click on it here. Then go and click on search this list and go and search for Roblox. And as you can see, it goes and says Roblox player for Rob or it's going to say Roblox player for your name. Go and click on it and then you can go and click uninstall. Go and click uninstall again. And then as you can see, it's now uninstalling Roblox. So wait for this to finish and then we'll go and re-download it. And once it's finished, you're going to go and get this message here saying Roblox has successfully been uninstalled. Go and click OK. And now you want to go back to Roblox to re-download it. Then once you're on Roblox, go and choose a game you want to go and play. So I'm going to go and click on speed run 4 and then I'm going to go and click on play. And then you're going to go and get this pop up here, which I'm just going to go and click back onto my browser. And you have to go and click download and install Roblox. And then it's going to go and drop the launcher down here. So you want to go and click on it once, and then it's going to go and say connecting to Roblox, and it's going to go and start the full install process. So you can sit back and relax while it goes and installs. Then it will say Roblox is successfully installed, and you can then go and get into your game. So press OK, and then you can go and click join again, and Roblox is going to go and launch into your game. If you found this video useful and it did go and fix the Roblox error code, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.